All right, time to load up the track. Here I go. It's the Ace of Vegas, the Ace of Vegas. All right, Spinners and Sharks, welcome back to Ace of Vegas. Ace here, and I hope you're doing well. Well, guys, this is it. This is the very end of the Best Games in My Vegas series. I think we'll have one more episode after this where we go ahead and count up all the booty that we've gotten over the year. And then uh, we'll see which game actually is the best and which one's given us the best payback over a certain period of time. So we'll go ahead and get this one started. This one's a thousand and one wilds, and this one is based on the uh, Arabian uh, fairy tale of the same name, a thousand and one uh, Arabian Nights. Uh, mainly the frame story, where I believe the uh, princess's name is Shahrazad. I can't pronounce it correctly. So she marries the king, King Shahir, and uh, her and her sister uh, make a habit of telling stories, and that's because King Shahir uh, he uh, he vowed to kill one new bride every night for some reason, so she'd tell him a story before he went to bed, um, but she'd always end it on a cliffhanger, and then, um, and ended up doing that for like three years straight or something crazy like that, so point is, you know, she'd, she'd tell a different uh, Arabian fairy tale, ended on a cliffhanger, and then uh, he'd have to delay her execution, and uh, yeah, that, that's basically the whole story, and then you get a whole bunch of other frame stories that go, in for, or uh, other stories within the frame that go from there. Uh, so yeah, so we'll go ahead and uh, get this all pumped up. Uh, I'm feeling pretty uh, pretty wild today, so I'm willing to put. Uh, let's get into the major jackpot over here. Let's uh, let's make this kind of fun. Let's go ahead and put. Uh, yeah, I think we're gonna put a 15 million chips through the machine every single time here. So we're gonna go real big with this one. Actually, start burning some uh, loyalty points here. So 15 million through the machine. Meaning that by the time we get through with this, uh, we'll be over a billion chips that we've uh, put through the machine in a day. So we'll go ahead and see how this goes. So yeah, let's get those 100 spins on the clock for our very last My Vegas game. Our mark, get set, ready, and go. Alright, cool, cool. And I think the whole uh, shtick in this one is there's supposed to be a whole bunch of wilds over here. And then uh, free spins are definitely supposed to be a big thing. Uh, so we'll go ahead and see how that goes going forward with the rest of the game here. Alright. And I still haven't gotten any major matches. Uh, hopefully we'll get some good free spins that go through. Okay, we got some free spins. Let's see how these go. Alright, so we just gotta activate... We gotta activate wilds over here, whatever that means. So hopefully we'll go ahead and get some good... Uh... Oh, okay. So we got a heart over here. And that gets us another free spin, and allegedly maybe some more wilds here too, so let's see what happens. Alright. Oh, that's another heart. For yet another free spin. An addition oh, and additional wilds have been activated. So that's how you get more wilds. You just get a couple more actual alright, so you put them on a cliffhanger, that's how that works. Okay, cool, cool. That's another free spin. And hopefully we get some more wilds here. Oh, all right, so they just kind of drop in wilds every once in a while. Another one with a free spin. Oh, okay, cool, cool. So we're going to be looking for more wilds. All right, so if we line up, line them up in the first two, we're going to get some good... Okay, 27 million, that's not bad. And if we line up the first three, we're going to be looking at a big win. Ah, uh, that wasn't it. All right, so if we line uh, up the first four, we're looking at... Oh, okay, that was a good one, 65 million. And I would like to get one more really good wild drop in. Oh, 100 million on that one. Yeah, buddy. That was great. See how far we get with this. All right. And then I think we got our last couple uh, free spins over here. And last one, last one. Let's make it a big one. Line them up. Give us five. All right, that was three. That's not bad. All right, so we won 200 million off of that. That's a good place to start. And we got another big win, 42 million on that one there. All right, this is actually kind of a cool game. Looks like very high risk, very high reward. And we'll be picking up a lot of loyalty points going forward, it's looking like. As long as we just hit those uh, free spins, we'll be okay. So here, here's hoping we'll get some more free spins, and then we can uh, resurrect our bankroll. So uh, something tells me we're gonna burn through a lot of our bankroll here. All right, cool. Up, oh, nothing on the jackpot there. I think we gotta get at least three for a minor jackpot, and then we'll get something else out of it. 
Oh. And we're just one off of the main one. Yeah, guys, so, yeah, this is gonna be the last one. Oh, here we go, more free spins. This is crazy. I've never had so many, uh, I haven't had a good set of free spins like this in a while. I think we had one Konami game that was just nuts. All right, and we got a bonus already, so we're gonna get one more free spin, and then we're gonna start threatening some more wilds here. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, now we get uh, now we get the magic carpet. We get Aladdin dropped in. You know, I heard a rumor that Aladdin actually wasn't originally part of the uh, 1001 Arabian Nights there. Uh, but he just kind of got added in for, like, a uh, one of the translations, which I think is kind of cool. Got me one of my favorite movies when I was a kid. Always good stuff. I really wish they would uh, come up with a good Arabian-themed resort. So we're, we're getting ready to go to Aria. We just came back from Vidara, as you guys know. And uh, getting ready to go to Aria in uh, about a week, about next week, uh, towards the end of the week, we're going to be going just for the weekend. And going to be hitting the Titanic exhibits and a couple other good exhibits out there. So it'll be a good time. And I'm really looking forward to getting, you know, getting out of the city, you know, going to the not-so-city, just hitting up the casino, having a good time, and getting away. So that'll be a good thing, and I think we've got some pretty good uh, rewards worked out. So I look forward to that. And I'm uh, looking forward to seeing how the series ends, too. So I'll do do the big math, so I'll let you know which uh, game's finally going to be the best one. I've been working on this series for a long time, really looking forward to that, and looking forward to moving on to some other, even more interesting experiments in the future. All right, cool. Yeah, that was like two uh, two free spins in, uh, in the first hundred. That's actually pretty good. So this uh, game is kind of generous with the wilds, I see. And even in Vegas last time, I had pretty good luck with slots here, so... We're actually holding uh, holding together pretty good, all things considered. We're only down by like 50 million chips. Oh wow, that was nice of them. All right, 67 million, just to keep me rolling there. So this is pretty routine. Don't I days? I really wish I remembered the story a little better. I'll probably have to look it up to get ahead and see how the rest of the story went. But uh, a lot of it's just kind of telling uh, a lot of it's telling other stories and saying, hey, you know what? You, you, you could kill me. I mean, you gotta kill me tomorrow, so I can't tell you how the rest of the story goes. And the king's just enthralled the whole time, so... I really wish we could get something that was kind of themed like that in Vegas. Um, I bet you the old Aladdin Hotel probably had something cool like that, but that got demolished some time ago, unfortunately, so... We'll never get to see a show like that ever again, unfortunately. And unless Cirque du Soleil decides to go ahead and do that, and they'll just go ahead and put their fun French spin on it. Like, they do their fun... French spin on Zumanity, and then uh, they did theirs on uh, Ka as well, too. So, good times. Uh, not my favorite shows, but, you know, definitely good times, though. So, you can't uh, you, you can't really go wrong with the Cirque shows. There's just a lot of them that I don't particularly care for. And I think it's just the narrative sometimes, or lack thereof, that seems to be the problem. I, li I, I like shows with a big narrative attached to them, or at least uh, that are a bit more cohesive. I think I think that's probably why I liked uh, Spoiler for my upcoming Ka review. I think I enjoyed uh, Zumanity a bit more than Ka, just because Zumanity, uh, it, it, it had a bit of a looser narrative, but, you know, I just kind of knew what was going on the whole time. Versus Ka, I took a little more paying attention, uh, which is cool. Uh, not, not so much a problem there, but it definitely took, uh, took a little more to make sure you're keeping up with the narrative. And also, so a lot of it was left up to interpretation, which is one thing. And then the, yeah, it was just, it, it was kind of story heavy without a lot of story. And then there just wasn't a lot of direction, like I couldn't tell when things were moving on and why they were moving on. It's just, you know, people showed up and people ran off and it was funny and it was cool, but yeah, that's about it. Another 24 million. Nice, all right. Oh, that would have been great to get five in a row and share. Oh, 120 million, there we go. Speak of the devil. Or the uh, the queen, really. And I think I'm actually ready to max out these loyalty points over here, so we'll be getting like 400 per, uh, per swing there. Yeah, this is killer, guys. You know, I never bet max, but this would have been amazing just to bet max on. I don't think I have the bankroll to totally max bet it. One of these days, we'll just do a, what happens if you bet max for 100 spins. Spoiler warning, it'll just be losing the entire bankroll. Oh, there we go. That's another big one, another 100 million win. We're on our last 10 spins over here. Hopefully we can get one more really good uh, set of wilds on this. 
So if we do, and then we end with a pretty high payback percentage, that'd be a pretty awesome way to end the series. Because as of right now, I don't think we're doing great, or if we got like a major jackpot or something like that. That would be in pretty insane too, but I don't think we're going to do that in the next few spins. Alright, I think we only got like three spins left. Alright guys, and our next spins our very last one. And that's the end of it. Alright guys, stage clear. That was 1,001 wilds at 15 million per spin. So that leaves us with a bank balance of 1 billion, 21 million, 381,324 chips. So now it's time for the very last time to do some maths and of course count up the booty. Alright guys, so we are back at it again, and 1001 Wilds unfortunately isn't quite strong enough to beat out our exotic deal over here, our 100 million chips for 99 cents. Um, it looks like we only had a payback percentage of 82.68%, so not bad, a lot of flashy games that went with it, a lot of flashy wilds and bonus features and all that. So is it the worst game in my Vegas slots? No, but unfortunately it didn't be the, it didn't make the best on the list. So we are forced to leave that off. Um, now that being said, this is probably the last time I get to do this for a while until my Vegas comes out with another game. Then we can go ahead and compare it with the current champion um, after I've done my other video where I determine based on all the games that I've played since I want to say something like August of 2018 up until presently we'll see which one of those games is actually the best game in my Vegas lots so yeah guys this is the end not the end of Ace of Vegas thankfully we'll have some more videos in the future but um, no just uh, up until then we're just gonna be waiting on some new games and I'll be able to go back to playing this one for fun instead of having to work on the experiment and I'll have I'll have a great video written up for the experiment I've been waiting for this for a very long time uh, but yeah guys until next time this is Ace of Vegas signing out and I'm wishing you strong hands and of course happy spinning you guys